So what are we talking about today then? Well, I want to know what was going on over at the thing last night. Oh, that was a great event yesterday, yeah. Wonderful event. Lots of nice people. Parking lot was busy, like a local community centre. And everyone was having a great time. I just wondered what was going on there because I could see like cameras and lights and all this kind of stuff going on. So but inquisitive being me, I thought, hey, I'll investigate, which I did. And so I walked over there and they're actually uh, videoing a, a video of a video, I guess. I don't know what you mean to say. But anyway, so they're doing a video and I thought, oh, interesting so I'm standing there in the backdrop and all that kind of stuff and it goes backwards and forwards and I, I didn't realize like um, the old days about like people being caught out for lip syncing this kind of stuff there was no like audio and like it's just an individual going through his moves and all that which is great to see wonderful and all that right and the people around there doing all the wonderful stuff and I'm going, oh, this is this is great and that it, it took it took me like because i'm old it took me a while to realize there's actually there's no sound and that's what i figured like oh it's like they're not in sync or you can't call it lip syncing because they're not doing it so the individual who's doing his thing and right nice nice wonderful young fella and all that doing all his stuff and it was great, and at one point in whatever, someone said to me, said, would you like to take part in this, and whatever, and I said, well, yeah, for sure. yeah, why not, and all that. So I did the thing, and whatever, and I did my bits and pieces, and all that kind of stuff, and great, great vibe, wonderful people, and all this kind of stuff, and, and, and at the end of it, I'm thinking to myself, I gotta know more about this this individual and the band and what's going on on that, because again it's in our local community centre. So I thought oh, I'll go in and check it out, right? So I go in there and so I belly up to the counter. There's a young lady there and she's whatever, and she's got like so I I see six dollars, whatever. So I I pulled out three loonies, right? I'm not a cheap person who would have happily have given a tip or whatever at that point in time, but you do that generally after the event. But anyway, so as I get to this point, the lady, young lady goes, taps on the piece of paper on the counter with like the price and all that. It said $60. Well, hang on a minute, right? Here's me being me, right? I'm an old person. I can't blame it on my eyesight. Well, I could if I wanted to. I thought it said six dollars. No, sixty dollars to go in and see this individual who was wonderful and all that. And I took part in the video. And he might take this down now and trash me. I don't. I don't blame him. But I think he was a wonderful guy. He was huge, humongous, great, great show. Right, sixty dollars to go into my local community centre where I could fall out of bed and I'd be outside the front door, right? But, okay, I'm so humiliated and embarrassed because I don't have $60, right? And probably never will have $60. But anyway, I had a six, right? Three, bright and shiny, right? Two knees, right? But no. So I went. I walked away dejected, right? I didn't say, hey, I've just been in a bleeding video here with the dude doing the stuff inside your venue, right? Didn't want to say that, right? I'm not going to use that. I'm not going to hang that on you, young girl, at the counter going, tapping the counter saying, 60 freaking dollars to get in to watch the guy you were just in a in video with. Anyway... But that's my side of the story. It's not, well, it can be verified because there were all the people around me. But they traveled off to Edmonton because I helped them load their truck to the new venue. And that's where it ends. Thank you, guys. Have a nice evening, morning or afternoon. Goodbye now.